hazelnuts rejoice. Sister Hazel is back in town. Sister Hazel formed in Gainesville, Florida, right here back in 1993 and have had several hits throughout the years. Their biggest right there, all for you. While the entire band couldn't be with us today, we are still thrilled to welcome to the show Ken Block and Drew Copeland. How are you hey, guys? For us. We're, not, we're not as good as we were then, man. Yeah. That was kind of great. That was guy was so back at those young. Videos. It's, really, it's really hard to wrap our head around it. But we, I mean, we've been a band now for 20, almost 23 years, 22 yeah. years. Yeah. Um, it's really, it's really a little bit surreal, but we're so grateful. And the People same band, yeah. Natalie and I were talking yeah. about that too. The same, same guys. The same guys. And that's yeah. longer than a mar than most marriages <laughs> no, these really days. Is. Yeah. I it's mean, to go from friends to having a band with this longevity, well, what's you the secret? You know, you know, a tour bus is great, right? Uh -huh. But it's still like us living in a single wide trailer with five band guys and six band guys now and a crew and all that. But so what's the secret? A good sense of humor, <laughs> wouldn't you say? Yeah. I mean, you got to pick your battles. You know, we, we've had our moments for sure over yeah. the years. But in the last few years, we've really kind of, yeah, I'm as proud of that as anything. I mean, our families come first in our band, our kids and our wives and all that. Um, but the, the ability that we've had to make it through a lot of the ups and downs of the music industry and creating together, um, I'm proud of the fact that we're still As creating. long as everybody does what I ask them to. It's <laughs> we're not allowed to look at them. It's we all good. It's a good marriage the then. Right. Works out really well. No direct eye contact with the person. That's why I'm facing you guys. <laughs> I love that. I love it. Hey, you guys are in town. You were in Clearwater on Friday. Yeah. Still got a couple events here in Florida coming up. Yeah. But uh, talk about what the new direction is for you guys. And kind of we were talking about the, the kind of genre of music music that I yeah. think back in the 90s the, um, it's kind of changed a lot since then has, you don't hear much has. of that so yeah. how do you describe the new sound we're gonna hear a little bit of well, it in I just think a minute. for us we kind of we kind of are who we are the five of us get behind our instruments and and it sounds like sister hazel you know we can lean this way or we can lean that way uh, but we it's always been hard when people go what kind of music do you play and I'm like well there's a little rock there's a little country there's a little southern rock there's a little folk there's a little you know all these different mm -hmm. elements mm -hmm. well this year when we put this record out I mean we were blown away it was a number 12 rock record it was the number six indie record and the number four country record on billboard magazine uh, for a band that's been together two decades and it really was gratifying to say there's some there's all those elements kind of being pointed at so country music yeah I think the lane's gotten wider wouldn't you say yeah it's gotten massive it's gotten wider to include some different things and i think you know rock on our alternative or different things that we might have fallen into I, it's gotten a little bit narrower, so we've we've never lo loved being labeled as anything. It went this narrow. It went pretty yeah. narrow. <laughs> there, no, you can't listen. There's like a bike. Well, lane. a lot of those bands that came out when we when we yeah. when we were coming up. I mean, Matchbox 20, even some of those songs, mm -hmm. which you know you consider them a full blown rock band, but some of those songs that came out back then, they probably would find themselves on a country station somewhere. And Tom Payne and the Heartbreakers, yeah, yeah, yeah. another band out of Gainesville, their stuff would be considered country now. With, yeah, there with, was another band that came you know, out of Gainesville. Yeah, a little band, I'll Tom Payne, the Heartbreakers. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if you've ever heard of them. Heard them once or twice. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, no. And it's been, the, I, I will say that because of the writing for this record, there are some things that lean a little little one way or another. Um, th this this record, we kind of, it took us a long time. We were five years between records this time, and a lot of it had to do with branching out with our songwriting. A lot of times we had been writing within the band. This time we kind of wrote with, we collaborated with a lot of different writers. A lot of, a lot of people in Nashville, because our management's been out of Nashville now for the past almost 10 years, um, we've been doing our last few records up there yeah. so we've been collaborating with people up there and you know sometimes you can't help but the influence from that and it's it look it's welcomed I mean people uh, the reaction we're getting from the new records great and and uh, so we're really enjoying it we're, we're just we, happy we to see some of your t people may be in Nashville you guys have stayed here though we did. I want to address we're, before we run out of time because you said there's nothing like performing here uh, of Florida. course Gainesville certainly close to the Bay Area what is yeah. it like when you perform at shows like true County here. Florida yeah. yeah it's it's great the Sunshine State we've always kind of felt like um, uh, it shaped who we were, you know, growing up, going to the going to the east coast of Florida, the west coast of Florida, north central Florida, kind of where we are, going down to the Keys. We used to play down there, uh, you know, of course, coming from a college town. Yeah. Uh, but it's I went to the opposite college town, by it's the okay, way. It's okay, but you know what? We had we, we, <laughs> yeah, oh, Tallahassee. Was a okay? Why'd fans? you say it's no, okay? No, That's no, not no. okay. I mean, I'll it's okay. Tallahassee, <laughs> Tallahassee was a huge uh, help in getting the, our band sort of outside of Gainesville, kind of blowing up yeah. a little bit. So um, we've always felt like ambassadors for Florida. Um, I come down here to Indian Rocks Beach, stay with my friends, the Plumleys, a lot, and it's kind of my safe place to get away on the west coast of Florida. So. I like that. I'll say we'll claim y'all. We, we yeah, like having yeah, you guys the ambassadors yeah, yeah. of our and real state. Quick, Camp Hazelnut, I wanted yeah, to make yeah. sure. That is amazing oh, what thanks. you guys are doing. Real quickly. Well, real like quickly, that. you know, we, we've, we've founded a lot of big events. One was the Rock Boat, which is coming out, at, leaving out of Tampa, coming mm -hmm. up in February. Um, 
and and we had the, the hazelnut hang but we started this thing last year called camp hazelnut we took over the camp where we grew up going outside of Gainesville camp crystal lake i lost my little brother to cancer he was diagnosed at 14 i was 16. Uh, he passed away at 18. all of us have been impacted by cancer mm -hmm. and so we started um, raising money through our foundation lyrics for life and raised about a million dollars for programs and research that support yeah. those families but camp hazelnut we invite a ton of these kids from uh, children's cancer center down here in tampa Mm -hmm. um, last year, in fact, we're bringing a bunch more this year, and they get to come with the, you know, the the kids and siblings and their moms or dads, and they come up there, and we just have a great weekend. Three days, music around the campfire, archery, ropes course, canoes, Aww. you know, a real summer camp experience where where they can kind swimming. of swimming, <laughs> swimming, I like milk this game turning, butter turning, know, yeah. uh, waving, some, <laughs> dance, wave, right? I don't know all the hand signals. Well, now we're going to keep playing yeah, music. Play, play, play yeah. Let's get to this. <laughs> so stay right there. We're going to hear more of from their new albums. Yeah, yeah. new album, Lighter in the Dark. Thanks,